Okay, hit it. Today we're going to be shooting some through night TI3 flashlights out of a shotgun. And you've probably seen the videos by Matt V2099 and Demolition Ranch where they shot the same flashlight out of their shotguns. One of my viewers wanted to come out and shoot with me, so I invited him and he is going to use this Benelli Nova 12 gauge shotgun. Okay, hit it. Oh yeah. See it? Lost it. It's still going. It's on. There it is. It survived. Many viewers on both Matt B 2099's and Demolition Ranch's videos had mentioned they should have shot it at night. It's very difficult to film something like this in the pitch dark. So we tried to find a, a happy medium shooting with heavy overcasts near dusk and it seemed to work out just right. We were even able to film high speed using an, you know, the backlighting of the clouds. Somehow I was able to track the flashlight as it was tumbling around and flickering in the sky and track it with the cameras. I honestly don't know how high it went, but it ended up going about 100 yards out into the field, even though he was pointing the shotgun almost straight up into the sky. It's really remarkable that a flashlight could survive the sudden g-forces and the shock from a shotgun and actually survive something like that it just blew me away the one we found on the field and it's still muddy let's see if it still works it still works out of a shotgun like a half a mile in the sky hey quarter mile like long that. long ways up there in a long fall impressive Okay, shoot. I don't I didn't see that one. There's the wadding. I see something. No, it's a bird. <laughs> now we shot a total of four of these flashlights. One of them stayed lit, the other three did not, and I think the only thing that happened was the G forces pushed the battery back and basically turned the flashlight off on three of the shots as we fired them. We recovered one flashlight. So out there in that field, there's about $60 worth of flashlights. If you can find them, you can have them. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. We had a lot of fun making this. Thanks for watching.